we want to teach our students to think and act more like experts do. And peer instruction is a powerful technique for supporting this goal. Effective peer instruction requires a good question that gives each student an opportunity to practice being an expert. I want to show you two questions, one that's not great and one that's better. Here's a question you might ask in an introductory physics course. Pause the video, read this over, and then hit play when you're ready. What's this question asking students to do? Asking them to memorize Newton's third law, not what it means or how to apply it, just spit out the words. That's not physics. Physics is not about memorization. Physics is about taking concepts and applying them and working out how the world works. Plus, if I choose B and you choose A and our instructor says, please turn to your neighbors and convince them you're right, you would say, uh, no, it's every action is an equal and opposite reaction. And I'd say, oh yeah, you're right. I got the wrong one. And that would be it. That's our whole conversation. We don't talk about physics like experts, not with this question. Here's a better peer instruction question to probe the concept of action and reaction. Again, pause the video, read it over, hit play when you're done. The options here sound good. It's about mass and traction and inertia and accelerating things more quickly. They all look reasonable. Only one of them is right. It's B, the team with the better traction wins because they push harder against the ground. But if I choose an answer and you choose an answer and we agree, we can check that we're agreeing for the same reason. And if we disagree, I have to talk to my peers. I have to talk to my friends and say words like larger mass, traction, inertia, smaller, quicker, pulling, heavier. These are all physics words. These are the kinds of things that physicists do. So answering this question first on my own, then a discussion with my neighbor, and then finally in a class-wide discussion with me and the instructor and everyone else in the room, this gives me a chance to think and act and sound and practice being a physicist.